Alright, what the fuck is this shit? We got K Rule versus. Or sorry, we got. Me Gunner versus fucking. Game and Watch. This ought to be stupid. Can't, like, most of his attacks be fucking bucketed? Alright, well, there's full bucket. Um, so that's basically a full stock, right? Like... Is that, like, Bucket will kill right now, right? Right? Looks like Johnny doesn't give a fuck. Apparently not. I, I mean, he shields it, so... That's gonna be the stock. Alright, you know... Um... That... Wow. Johnny just not giving a shit about Game & Watch and anything this character is doing, apparently. Th this is kind of funny to watch. But, Game & Watch does reflect... Game & Watch's bucket's so fucking weird now that it has, like, the reflecting properties. Alright. Finally taking the stock. That was... I looked away. I'm assuming he stage backed him with up B. Uh, that's a full charge. Right. Two. Oh, only 20%. Okay. Yeah, that's not that bad. Actually, Johnny and I played this matchup a little bit before, so... Didn't they turn- I guess maybe they toned down Bucket a little bit? I, yeah, I actually have no fucking idea. Bucket also calculates the position of the stars relative to your GameCube control divided by two. In binary, right? Gamma Bucket Mathematician. Doom, doom. This is surprisingly an even game. I. Yeah, I don't know what to say about any of this, to be honest with you. How. It's so odd, like, that that reflected and not, like, it didn't actually buck at the time. Okay, there's the forward smash. Johnny taking the second stock. Um. Yeah, video game. That, that's, a, that's a pretty good way to put it in MHD. Um, yeah, video games. Johnny taking game one with the clutch two stock, not giving a shit about buckets. Bucket is so broken, it adds a fifth move to other Pokemons. <laughs> hey, Peace, are you still in chat right now? Bucket got pan tubers. So I was looking through, I guess this is an odd thing, I don't know if Peace talked about this at all on like his Twitter or anything, but I was looking through one of his brackets and Peace actually beat AC at a Wi-Fi tournament recently. For those of you who don't know, AC is a former top 50 player. And I believe number 11 on SoCal's PR, so that's pretty sick, I would say. Oddly enough, kept because it's worse than Lilat. <laughs> My man Peace been grinding and putting his name out there. Let's go. 
Yeah, he's actually accrued some decent wins and some pretty good placements. Like, he's been placing on the same level of a lot of really good players. And, you know, the wife I met is fucking weird, so... It's hard to say how good he would actually be doing at stuff, but, um... I actually think possibly a little bit better. But maybe a little bit worse. The point is, like, yeah, he's been putting Siwa on the map a bit. Just gotta see him get, like, those real big wins sometime soon. Anyways... Game number two. K rule is the pick, so we got an actual game. Even with Wi Fi, he's starting to get some recognition? Really? Oh, that's great. Yeah, fuck yeah. Puts you on the map, man. Alright, so we got Teddy Bear, Me Gunner as the counter pick, K rule as the actual counter pick. And, I don't know, maybe this will work out. K. Rule, I do think, is actually uh, Kid's best character. But also, this seems like a really annoying matchup for K. Rule to deal with, so. But then again, Me Gunner's just an annoying matchup for everyone to deal with, so, you know. House Preview is the best song? Uh... No. But alright. Sure. I mean, we're entitled to wrong opinions, I suppose. Hitting him with that stealth shot. I do like that taunt quite a bit. There's something about that taunt that he just reloads. You know, here's a fun little thing you can do. If you ever do down taunt, uh, he like fucking puts his gra hand into the ground. It almost looks like he's charging something. If people don't know the Me Gunner matchup, which is pretty much everyone, they'll think that you're charging some different, um, some different special. So you just do that to fuck with him. Yeah, that. Johnny's listening to the stream right now. is actually really funny for getting in your opponent's head. Yo, mid-set coaching. You know it, dude. Gotta love it. Neutral B-spam at the edge. Kid timing the invincibility on neutral get up perfectly there to get through it. Ooh, and combos that crown into the nair. And crown coming out again. There's the blunderbuss. But not going all the way. Johnny knows how far he needs to stand. Knows the range on that move. Hits him with the forward smash. But there's the armor on it. Jacktail's flying everywhere. Okay, kid with the ledge trap. Gets him with the down smash. But it's the weak hit. The dash attack whiffing. Up throw into the up air. Not going to kill quite yet. Town and City, very large stage. Gets the cell shot, but misses it. Alright, gets hit by the crown. Doesn't get comboed into anything, but it almost does. Stealth shot going to kill quite again. Once again, big commitment from the crown. Not a good idea when he's stealth shotting. Down throw into the nair. He's gonna up air? No. Another nair. Ooh, good get up attack to just get off the ledge. And is he gonna live? Yeah, okay. K rule can act pretty quick out of air dodge. That's nice for K rule. Kid on his tournament life right now. Very high percentage. There's the crown. Is he gonna pick up the crown? Pick up the crown! Pick up the crown! Oh. K roll with the crown back on his head. Another stealth shot. There's the crown. Oh, we could have up aired in there. Down throw. And, okay. Barely kills with the, what? Down tilt? Up smash? I don't know. But the stealth shot, that's gonna be it. Because people don't know how to air dodge. Johnny taking a game 2-0 over Kid. And moving on to loser's semis. Or loser's, loser's finals, yeah. House Preview is not the best song. What the fuck? What is wrong with you guys?